What's going on, you beautiful business owner, you? My name is Lori Vachega. I am the CEO and founder of a well-known company called Viral Growth Media. We're one of the world's top performance-based marketing agencies. So let me give you a little bit of background info. You're probably thinking, especially if you came in through our paid ad strategy, you're probably thinking, who who's the fuck is Laura? <laughs> like, what is Laura going to teach me? Like, how do I benefit from this whatsoever? Well, let me tell you, around four to five years ago, I was a nobody. Nobody knew who I was, right? Um, I was actually able to leverage Instagram. At the time, I only had like 300 followers. I was able to leverage Instagram to build my personal brand and I was able to monetize. So I was actually creating magnetizing content through Instagram without even knowing that I was creating it, right? Um, I went from 300 to 10,000 followers in like less than three months. I, I started getting um, influential people in the space that I was um, targeting to follow me to the point where I actually got my first speaking gig with Gary Vaynerchuk. So we were, we were like literally the top two headline speakers. And it was like my life literally changed like that. And through all this new attention that I got, I was able to grow my agency to seven figures. But at that time, I actually wasn't following my passion, right? I, I happened to be narrowed in on a niche that was making me a lot of money, but I wasn't working in the space that I actually loved. Um, I actually didn't know that I loved this space at the time. It was something that happened through trial and error. My passion is helping uh, influencers or personal brands or just regular people build an audience that gets value from them and monetizing them. I think it's super impactful. I think I think everybody is an expert at something and it's their right to monetize, especially in this day and age. Um, you'll be getting our reading list and... Uh, Prediction Machines is going to be a part of that reading list. It's the simple economics of artificial intelligence. The reason why I'm so passionate about helping regular people build a personal brand and monetize their knowledge is because the world is getting to a point where automation is going to take over these menial tasks, right? And EQ is going to be more valuable than IQ. Actually, I, I think we're already there. So I, I think it's important that people understand this new economy and building a personal brand is the simplest to me, the simplest and easiest way to make money online, really. Once I realized that this is where I wanted to go and this is where I wanted to shift my energy to, that's actually when I founded Viral Growth Media. Um, we specialize in working with coaches, consultants, really influencers, course creators, content creators that have something of value to give to the world and are actually impactful in what they do. Viral Growth Media is a done for you agency. We build out all their back end systems, their retargeting systems, everything you can think of. Like for example, Jay Shetty, and think of like his entire system to acquire clients into his coaching programs, into his certification programs, into his masterminds, into all those types of products. That's, that's the type of stuff we build up for these people. During the time I've been doing this, I've seen a lot of issues, a lot of mistakes that people are doing when building their personal brand. So one of the biggest mistakes I see is that people don't know who their ideal clients are. And it blows my mind. They say everybody is my ideal customer. Everybody can benefit from weight loss. You know, if you're a, if you're a fitness coach, I'm sure you probably think you can help everybody. You can't, I promise you. You need to be focused on a niche. So let's say you're a fitness coach and you, the person that's going to say, I help everybody versus the person that says, I help type two diabetics lose weight. Guess who's going to make more money? The guy who's focusing on the type two diabetics because the, he's creating content that attracts those people to them versus the person that says, I help everybody that is attracting nobody to them. <laughs> Another huge problem I saw was that people never had non-negotiables. For some reason, they were willing to do whatever it took to work with you know anybody <laughs> um, instead of having those boundaries you know i'm sure you probably in your business you've experienced uh clients maybe calling you at 3 a.m in the morning and you're like hello like that you need to set a boundary of who you can talk to at what time what are your office hours stuff like that other things or maybe you don't work with people that aren't coachable you don't work with people that 
don't have standards of living you know i mean it's up to you to decide what are your non-negotiables but that's along the lines of what i'm talking about a lot of people don't have those and it's one of the biggest mistakes that they do because it's sucking the soul out of their out of their business and themselves really i think another big mistake or maybe even this falls into the limiting belief category um when when people think that because they're not a celebrity or an authority that they can't bring value to their ideal clients. That's the biggest BS ever, right? So what we do is help you create a system and a process that helps you build up your audience, right? Your ideal clients. And it turns you into the authority in their mind, right? Because you'll be following them around the entire internet like, and them seeing you every single time. So they think you are the fucking shit. <laughs> and they think you are the person that they need to be doing business with. You have the solution to their problem. Also a huge problem that I see um, in the whole personal branding, uh, coaches, consultants, author space is that people don't know how to set up their sales funnels correctly. Um, they think that a website will, will solve all their problems. And you know what, it doesn't. But guess what, we're actually, going to show you how to be successful with a simple two-step sales funnel and no paid traffic. I'm the queen of paid traffic. <laughs> that's literally my specialty. That's, that's how I got all these big headline um, speaker gigs is because I talk about paid traffic. Well, guess what? I'm telling you, you can be successful. You can hit six figures. You can even hit up to seven figures without paid traffic. Obviously, I don't recommend that you like avoid paid traffic at all um, because that's gonna get you to true scale, right? But you gotta start somewhere. You do have to start organically. You have to test your offers. That's another thing that people mess up on, their offers. You know, a lot of people have offers that keep them broke and that's something we help solve. So th this is just like an overview about what we're gonna help you cover, how to improve the systems and processes, you probably don't even really have systems and processes or don't even really know what that means. And if you do, we're gonna help you improve them. If you don't, we're gonna help you create them and do them the right way. Because my goal is to help you build a personal brand that magnetizes your ideal customer to you, right? That's the goal here. I'm super pumped for what's to come. See you then.